Right now, next up, we're going to look at the back track. Yeah, we're going to go to the back track information gathering and then from there, network analysis. Yeah. Once you make it to the uh, network analysis, you want to go down to the SM to the SNMP analysis. And there we go to the SNMP check, also known as the SNMP enumerator. There you can see it's the enumerator. Now, as you can see, the usage is the SNMP check. However, if we do a listing, you could tell that it is actually uh, SNMP check dash one dot eight dot PL. Very easy to use. You need to know, of course, the uh, IP address, yeah, and the uh, community string as well. So the way we would do it is something like uh, dot slash SNMP check dash one dot eight dot PL with a minus T, which will be the target host, yeah. And here we put in the IP address of the target host, which in our case is the 85. All right, very good. So let's go ahead and run it and see what kind of information we get for this, yeah? Ah, yeah, the enumerator had gotten some good information here. So what we looked at in, in, in 0 0.27 seconds, yeah, we found a lot of information that the enumerator was able to give us. So as you could see, we have the host name, the description. We also have the system uptime, as well as the SNMP daemon. It's been 15 days already, yeah? And also the location, which is in Boise, Idaho. Hmm? It tells you if there's any DCP IP forwarding enabled, uh, the default time to live and so on. Any network interface, as well as the IP address and the network mask, of course, within that that the interface is up, the hardware address, and all good stuff. This is very good. Again, this is the SNMP check, also known as the SNMP enumerator. So check it out, SNMP enumerator.